Hey guys, so this is concerning. The ex wrestling star Daphne Unger did a Instagram live a few hours ago, and in it she seems very dishevelled, she seems very upset, and not particularly mentally well, and she certainly hints at self deleting. I can't say the actual word because my video will get into trouble if I do. I'll show you some bits of it, but I can't show you like the concerning bits because, again, it means that my video will be compromised if I do that, which is ironic because it's a shame you can't see it so that you know the condition she's in and therefore why people are concerned. Certainly here's one bit which is coherent and makes sense and you can watch this bit where she explains the kind of state she's in. Now in that she's mentioning head injuries that people get from doing sports like wrestling, some people get them from doing sports like rugby or American football and something she's mentioning there is quite important and that is that a lot of the head injuries people get that affect their brains in a bad way, sometimes they can't be identified until that person has passed away. If you watch on Netflix a documentary about Aaron Hernandez, you'll see this exactly happen with him. So they didn't know that anything was particularly wrong with him apart from the fact that he seemed to display these terrible criminal behavioural traits. And then after he died, when they studied his brain, they found out that he had severe damage to a part of his brain because of all the sports, the violent sporting episodes he'd been subjected to on the pitch. And it does happen to loads of NFL stars, loads of NFL players, sometimes you hear about them doing the craziest things and people often think it's because their brains have been injured by the playing and the impact that it's had on their physical and mental state. So I think she's trying to hint at that there. Later on she gets more distraught and She's crying and talking about how alone she is and it's just, I really hope that she's got friends and neighbours to look in on her or family to look in on her because she says she's alone. I think also what this does kind of illustrate sometimes is the sad effect of what happens when fame kind of goes, you know, when, when people are famous for a period and then it just stops and the phone stops ringing the offers stop coming in. I think it has a really bad effect on people mentally and I think that's a real shame because often these stars of a certain era, they fade away and they shouldn't really fade away, there should be stuff for them to do, they should be able to carry on but people move on, generations move on and they kind of forget about them and I think that's a, that's a real shame but it must have a terrible effect on them mentally because they were once doing really well and then suddenly nothing. So it's kind of really sad, I hope she's going to be alright. I know a lot of people are concerned for her, and let's hope we get a more positive update from her soon. Thanks for watching.